this is Pets in Action 101 and today's video is Luna's birthday vlog. So to start off this vlog, we're going to let Luna out and give her her birthday veggies. You want your tunnel? Let me get your tunnel. There she is. Is it your birthday, Bunny? Hello. All right, now it's time for her birthday veggies. She's got lots of special veggies for her birthday. All right, I'm gonna go get your veggies. For Luna's veggie breakfast, she'll be getting some romaine lettuce, some cabbage. I don't usually give her too much of the cabbage because it's just not one of her favorite vegetables. Um, some spring mix which has a bunch of different kinds of vegetables in it and a handful of oats to kind of sprinkle on top And now I'm going to wash the veggies. The next thing I do is I cut up some of the bigger vegetables so they're easier for her to eat. I don't cut them in so small slices, but I cut them about this size. So, especially the cabbage because it's kind of tougher than the romaine and the other vegetables. Now that these are cut, I can add the smaller vegetables, like the spring mix. And then I can add the oats to put on top. You may be thinking this is quite a lot of veggies for one small rabbit, but she, she, she will eat it. So Now I'm going to add the oats on top. Oats are her favorite thing. She will she could eat them all day. Doesn't mean I'm gonna let her, but it's her birthday, so I'm gonna add a little bit of extra oats on top. Now let's give it to her. 
All right, let's see how she likes it. Here's your birthday veggies. See, look at the veggie plate compared to her. She's pretty tiny. Shiloh stopped by to wish Luna a happy birthday. You gonna say happy birthday? Nope. Okay. Um, the thing about Shiloh and Luna, which is over there, still eating, she's a messy veggie eater, um, is Shiloh doesn't really care being around Luna and Luna doesn't care being around Shiloh um, nothing happens the only thing that uh, that Sh Shiloh does is she just she just sits in my room she doesn't go after Luna she doesn't even really notice Luna she she just sits there and Luna doesn't even pay attention to her so Shiloh and Luna are buddies, kind of. I don't know what you'd call that, like, kind of buddies. But, anyway, I don't know where I was going with that. Just if you guys wanted to know if Shiloh and Luna were okay in the same room. There you go. So, it is October 28th, which is Luna's birthday. And it is fall. It is really hot. But Luna's already getting her winter coat, if you guys wanted to see that. But you can see how fluffy her coat is. Now, if you want to see fluffy, go look up a video or I'll have a link below of a video of an Angora. Angoras are really fluffy and you actually have to cut their hair. You don't cut Jersey Wooly hair though. You just, we have to make sure we brush it a lot. And, but she's, as you can see, she's got a lot of it. A lot of fur. A lot. Am I messing with you? She don't like me messing with her fur. She likes being pet right here though. So it's now the afternoon. Well, actually to be exact, it is. I'll show you the time. 1 49. One fifty is one fifty, so it's almost two o'clock in the afternoon, and and she's just kind of relaxing, having her little afternoon nap. She ate quite a few of her veggies, not all of them, but quite a few for what was in there. They're all of they're all over the ground, of course. So she's just resting. Here in a little bit, she's gonna get up and be crazy like she normally is. She's just resting right now. Sleepy bunny. All right, I'm gonna leave her to her little afternoon nap. So I already told you how 
Luna and Shiloh are together and like if Shiloh's allowed the same room as Luna. And with Dixie, it's about the same. Before Luna actually got fixed though, they Luna was a lot territorial and she would not let Dixie even in the room without chasing after her. But Luna got fixed and we tried it out to see if she was still not liking Dixie. And so now she's just like Shiloh. She doesn't really care if Dixie's in the room. Um, sometimes she'll go up and just like sniff her or something. But she doesn't do anything. Dixie doesn't even pay attention to her. So It's about the same as Shiloh. Her cage is kind of a mix of her favorite things. It's dirty because it's about cleaning time. But uh, it's tie-dye and her favorite fleece, the moon fleece. And then over here is just some toys. And then there's the leaves from the last cage tour. And then just her food and water and litter box like always. And then her red barn, of course. But this is a usual setup without doing like a cage tour. Not really anything in the middle right now, but. Hello. You gonna give the camera a kiss? Oh, how sweet. So sometime in the day I give her these uh, oxbow, or oxbow, however you pronounce it. Um, like vitamins, like I don't know if it can if it'll focus for you. They're like, they're kind of like vitamins. That's what I call them. They're just like they have a bunch a bunch of vitamins like this. They have just regular vitamin C, I think. They have um, for older rabbits. They have some vitamins for them. This one's just skin and coat, just because it makes her coat look nicer and um, it just helps in different ways and it has some different stuff in it that helps with that. I'll leave the link down below where you can find these. They're really helpful and they're not that expensive for how many there is in there. I think there's like 60 or so. Yes, there's 60 in there. I just checked. Um, 60 things in it and they're pretty good size too. I'm gonna give her one right now so that you can see what they look like and the size and how she likes them. She loves them. She's going crazy down here because she wants them really bad. But they come in a good size package. That's them in there. I'm almost out. I'm gonna order a new kind here soon. So let's give her give her one. Like I said, she goes crazy for these. You want one? You want a treat? Even though they're healthy treats there, she goes she does all sorts of tricks. Around, up. Good girl. All right, let's give her one. <laughs> I know, bunny. You want a treat? You're in the camera. Hey. Ah, she's on top of the camera. Come over here. Alright, 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 I got it. Okay, come here. Okay, so, let's see if I can show you them. They're pretty good size, like I said. One minute, bunny, I know. They're a pretty good size, like I said, and I mean, they're... Anyway, but you can see the size. It's, it's a pretty good size. They're nice and they're not crumbly either, which is what I like in treats. They're not really messy. There we go. They're not messy or anything. They're pretty, pretty good size. All right, let's give it to her. Come here, bunny. See how bad she wants that? Now she's gonna go away. There we go. She really likes them. Like I said, I'll have the link to those below. You should really try them out. They're pretty good. I love them. Or Luna loves them. 
but they do help with her fur. With her growing fur. It is now 519 and Luna is still over here just kind of chilling but now now it's birthday cake time so we're gonna go make Bur Luna a birthday cake and um, here's her veggies like I said before, she's like a really messy eater, so she's got veggies laying on the floor. Before bedtime, I'll probably clean those up if she doesn't finish them off. But, um, sorry for the background noise. There's a, um, someone working with a hammer, so, and I gotta film because today's her only birthday. She didn't have five birthdays in a year, duh. But, um, um... Anyway, let's go make her cake. So I will be making this simple bunny safe cake with one banana and some oats. actually kind of bunny cupcakes that's what I calling them instead and I shaped them shaped one of them into a some of them into an L for Luna 
but I've been calling them cakes all this time, but they're actually more like cupcakes. So, if you want to make them, you can just call them like banana oat bunny cupcakes. So there's you a nice birthday meal. Anyway, Luna, here's your birthday cake. Happy birthday. Yummy, yummy. You like that? She probably likes the oats more than bananas. But oats and bananas are her favorite thing, so. Oh, she took a banana. Is that yummy, bunny friend? Well, I'm going to let her enjoy her bunny birthday cake. Hey guys, I just wanted to give you a quick update um, and say one last happy birthday to Luna before we roll on to the next clips. The next clips will be um, the day after Luna's birthday, which would be a Saturday, and, and tomorrow we will be expecting a package and also we'll have some other random clips. But I just wanted to say one last happy birthday to Luna. She loved today so much. She loved all the stuff we did. She loved the cake. She ate it up. And she'll have another fun day tomorrow. So she'll stay here for the rest of this video. Whoa, where are you going? She's right there. Anyway, I just wanted to say one last happy birthday to Luna, which... She's over there now, but but let's roll on to the next clips, which will be Saturday and tomorrow. So Hey guys, so today it is Saturday, and I just finished Luna's morning routine. I gave her her vegetables and filled her hay up and refreshed her water and stuff like that. And I just got my package, so we're going to go do an unboxing and give her her gifts. Um, everything I've gotten is from from PetSmart except for one item which is from Walmart and I will show you both things right now. Let's go on to the clip. So my first item is from Walmart and it's this plastic ball bird toy but it's just plastic so it's safe for rabbits and it's a hanging to toy and you can hang it up and even stuff some pellets in there for a rabbit or something and it's really colorful also I love all the colors it's blue pink yellow and green all my favorite colors and um, it'll look really cute in the rabbit cage and I bet she'll have lots of fun with it so like I said the rest of these items will be from PetSmart and I only got a few items but it came in this really big box I don't know if you can see that but it's pretty big Luna's trying to get to everything inside it. But the first thing it says, do not open with a sharp object. So I'm going to tear the tape off of it. <laughs> I'm going to tear the tape off of it and we'll see what's inside. So I'm just going to put you over here. So I had some trouble opening it, so I paused the video, but now let's see what's inside. So, so it's very nice packaged with this nice, whatever they call this, this little cushion stuff. So the first thing I have in here is her favorite item, which is the grass mats. 
is very large Peter's grass mat very large it's her favorite thing she tears it right up and she loves sleeping on it especially it's much bigger than the last one I got I'm very excited about this so yeah the last item I got in here is these cute layer cakes. They're so cute. I got them for like birthday cakes kind of. But they're just these wood toys. They're quite bigger than I thought they were going to be. That's pretty good. And they look just like cakes. They're from the brand KT. They weren't that expensive either. I'll put the price on the screen. I don't remember exactly what the price was. But she's going to love these. And also, there's, of course, the box. You can use that for something for your rabbit. Anyway, so let's see how she enjoys some of her toys. So I opened all her stuff. And a few things I want to say really fast is that the thing with this toy, it, it's really cute and it's I really like how it turned out. The only problem is you're going to have to attach your, if you want to hang it up, you're going to have to attach your own string um, to hang it up, which isn't a problem. Just get some, get some uh, rabbit safe string and just hang it up. And then, but other than that, it's really cute toy. They turn and everything. Totally jingly. She really likes jingly balls and jingly stuff as you've seen in previous videos so she's gonna really enjoy this the cakes are really cute I'm really impressed because they are bigger than I thought they would be there's nothing the, there's even holes in them so if you want to hang them up somewhere hang them up as little kebab toys one shaped as a heart One's a square. And the last thing is the he mat. And like I said, I'm really impressed how big it is. And see, that's my hand to it again. And then, but that's, this is it unfolding. So it's like double the size of Luna, which is great. Lots for her to chew on. So I'm gonna let her try the grass mat just to see how she likes it because she loves her grass mat. But I'm gonna save the toys and even the grass mat for an upcoming cage tour or if I don't do a cage tour just after I clean her cage just so they don't get all messed up right away here we go here bunny you want to try this out Luna come here see she loves her grass mat Hey guys, I'm going to end this vlog here. I didn't film very much throughout this day, but um, the unboxing and stuff, but all I did really was watch movies all day and stuff, and the only thing I did with Luna is I hung out with her for a little bit, but um, I forgot to vlog, so I'm going to end the video here. It is time for me to feed her, and I'm not going to film that, but... We're going to say goodbye right here. Thanks for watching. She had a wonderful birthday. Please comment, like, and subscribe. Bye!